The Goat Herd and the Wild Goats Once upon a time, there lived a goat herd. A goat herd is someone whose job it is to take care of goats. In old times, goats were an important part of people's lives. People kept goats for their milk. They used goat milk to drink, but also to make butter and cheese. People could also make clothes from goat hair. So in old times, if you had a lot of goats, you could make a lot of money. Now, there are two types of goats, tame goats and wild goats. Tame means an animal that lives with people. Wild means an animal that lives in nature. So, for example, a cat is tame because it lives with people, but a tiger is wild because it lives in the, lives in the jungle. However, with goats, there are both tame goats and wild goats. The tame goats were kept by goat herds, and the wild goats lived in the mountains. During the summer, the grass was green, and there was plenty of food for all the goats. But during the winter, the snow covered everything, and there was no food for the goats. During the winter, the goat herd always had a supply of grain, which he fed to his flock of goats. Grain is the seeds from types of grass that are eaten as foods, like wheat or rice. Flock is a group of goats. But the wild goats always went hungry during the winter. The wild goats noticed that the goat herd's flock always got food during the winter. So one winter, just as the first snow was beginning to fall, the wild goats sneaked into the goat herd's flock as the flock was, as, sorry, sneaked into the goat herd's flock as the goat herd was taking his flock into the fold. The fold is an area that is surrounded by a gate where the goats are kept for the winter. The goat herd noticed that the wild goats were sneaking in, but he didn't mind. In fact, he was quite happy to see the wild goats were joining his flock. After all, everyone knows that the more goats a goat herd has, the richer he is. Unfortunately, the goat herd only had a limited supply of grain to last for the winter. With all these new goats coming in, the goat herd didn't have enough grain for the whole winter if each goat ate fully. But the goat herd wanted to keep the wild goats happy so that they would stay with his flock. So the goat herd gave most of the grain to the wild goats. The wild goats could eat as much as they wanted all winter. But for his own goats, the goat herd only gave them just enough grain to keep them alive. And they were hungry all winter. When the spring came, the snow melted, and the mountains were once again covered with green grass. On the first day of spring, the goat herd opened up the gate to let his fox go out and eat the grass. As soon as the gate was open, the wild goats ran out and started running back into the mountains as fast as they could. Hey, yelled the goat herd angrily. What are you doing? Are you leaving me? You are ungrateful. I treated you very well. All winter, I fed you better than my own goats. The wild goats stopped briefly, and one of them turned around to answer the goat herd. But don't you see, said the wild goat, that is exactly the problem. We noticed that you were treating us much better than you treated your old goats. And we realized that you are the kind of person who always treats the new ones the best. So we are worried that someday you may get goats that are newer than us. And then what would happen to us? You would keep us hungry, just like you did to your old goats. And with that, the wild goats all ran back into the mountains and never visited the goat herd again. The moral of the story is, don't treat your new friends better than you treat your old friends.